The tale you are about to hear has never been told in the land of Kitakami, the tale of the mythical Pokémon, Pecherunt. Long, long ago, in a faraway land, there lived an old man and an old woman. Having no children of their own, they instead cared for a small, timid Pokémon named Pecherunt, and they loved it dearly. Pecherunt, seeking more of their affection, used the poison in its body to fashion special mochi, binding mochi, which it served to them. The couple was immediately enthralled by the flavor of these delectable mochi. Or rather, put under the thrall of Pecherunt. These binding mochi seemed to draw out the greed of anyone who ate them. Before long, the couple began hounding Pecherunt with requests for this, that, and every other little thing. They'll love me even more if I grant their wishes, it thought. So it used more binding mochi to tame a Pokémon and had it deliver the gifts to the couple the next morning. Thus did their love for Pecherunt grow and grow. Then, one day, the old couple requested something peculiar a brilliant set of masks which were rumored to exist in the land of Kitakami. Pecherunt, who had long grown tired of the same old requests, set off excitedly for the land of Kitakami, eager to retrieve the masks and grant the couple's wish. Every adventurer needs companions. So Pecherunt left the village with Okidoki, the retainer it had tamed with the power of its poison. But one companion wasn't enough. On the road, the two met Monkey Dory. This Pokémon had the power to see into the near future. It simply had to be made a retainer. Yet Pecherunt still worried, so it found a third companion, Pheasantipity, which could expel mesmerizing pheromones. Only then did Pecherunt feel safe. Thus did their journey finally begin. They crossed fields, mountains, and seas, until Pecherunt and its retainers arrived in the land of Kitakami. Amid the sound of festive drums and flutes, standing amongst the merry revelers, they saw two figures donning glittering masks, Ogrepan and its human partner, Pecherunt proceeded with caution. First, it had Monkey Dory track down where the two lived. Then, while Ogrepan and the man were away, it had Okidogi and Pheasantipity sneak into the den to quietly steal the masks. Just as they were about to return to Pecherunt, the man appeared. He rushed at the intruders, who had no choice but to fight back. But the man could only muster the strength to protect a single mask. And the thieving Pokémon made off with the remaining three in hand. At last, the glittering masks belong to Pecherunt. Now they'll love me even more, it thought. But its joy was fleeting. For the enraged Ogre Pond was upon them. Panicked, Pecherunt ordered its retainers to stand in its defense. Pheasantipity deployed its beguiling pheromones. Monkey Dory used its foresight to predict Ogrepan's attacks. And Okidogi tried to finish the fight with its raw might. But none of them could stop Ogrepan's terrifying advance. As Ogrepan drew near, Pecherunt trembled. It knew its fate was sealed. The masks, its companions, its happy life, Pecherunt had lost them all. As it was sent careening through the air, it mustered the last of its strength to withdraw into its shell. On and on it rolled, until it finally came to a rest somewhere in the forest. Perhaps it rests there still, waiting to be awakened, so it can finally grant the old couple's wish. <laughs>